So this is welcome, enjoy your stay, and then upgrading instructions. Now this is where we're going to get them for making fun of Mary Boots, of the Blue, and Haley Boots, and the Team Juta. Okay. So Karen, Karen, and I, Brian, you might want to quote this. Didn't they say she said to hold the Faust name or Zillig name to the very end and be proud? So we tried to do that, and yet Bernard and the Robo Knight and that team there say that. Um, I'm and Perlita tried to make it people believe that I'm an illegal citizen, but I'm not. And uh, that's kind of conflicting. Why would you say to be proud and hold a name, Karen, and then make people with your little minions of Cowboy Western there and Perlita make people think that I'm illegal, but then. But then turn around and say, no, that's not, we accept you now. That's not it. You're accepted. Back and forth, back and forth. Um, so how can we hold true and be proud of our family's sake if that's what you and Joe and Harry, Karen, and your cowboy team with Perlita do? It's impossible. So to help the Navy, the Coast Guard, and the police, and the, you know, you, if you want to, group of you want to play elitism, then you will find no other better team to perform the task of elitism than the Navy and the Navy SEALs and the fighter pilots, the police, the military of Colorado and here and the United States, firefighters, doctors in the world. See, if they're going to play that game with you, my friend Navy and military air force of the world, play it with them. See, let's prove that they make fun of Team Judah and Haley Boots and they took away our teeth because some cowboy country and western people cannot handle the truth. So, so Space Station Coronado, Navy SEALs, and fighter pilots, and those special forces of the world, show them what elitism truly is, as opposed to crazy cowboy country and western and rap. Because, Karen, me and the Navy have never been wrong. And so, if you really want to compete with that kind of elitism, and you're going to challenge our namesake just so Joe could swap it around for his crap, then, you know, I can't be proud of our namesake, Joe, if you take it away from your children in the first place and you become a traitor against Mary Boots and Hitler Boots, swapping back and forth. Get it? I'd much rather have kept our teeth, Joe, instead of you guys jack it up.